Hi everybody, this is Kevin Purcell for Notebooks.com and I want to show you my watch. <laughs> you're looking at that big old thing and you're thinking, you actually wear that? Yeah, for now I do. It's kind of nice. You turn it on and there it's got a fairly nice face, you know. But what this actually is, is an iPod. That's right, I got one of those uh, little iPod Nanos, the newest generation. And when I got it, I thought, well, you know, I have an iPhone. What am I going to use that thing for? And so I said, you know what? I want to try out one of those iPod Nano watch bands. And I looked around for a bunch of them, and I tried to decide which one I would get. Most of them are just cheap bands, you know, that you clamp the iPad, iPod into. But this one is from Griffin, and it's the uh, Slap Band. You take it off, and it will become a straight line and then you put it on by slapping your wrist <laughs> I, mean, I didn't get a good slap on there let me try that again and you just kinda do it like so <laughs> now I'll be honest with you this is almost a, a joke product for me um, I can't imagine people wearing these things but you know I'm gonna try it out and see how I like it and see what the reaction that people have to it I've just gotten this thing in. Uh, actually, just got it through the uh, the mail yesterday. But it's kind of interesting, you know. It's got your watch on here, and you can go here. And, and there's a setting in the iPad. I'm sorry, in the iPod Nano, where you can have it every single time it turns on, it shows that. And then you just swipe. See there, you've got your stopwatch. You've got a timer, and you go back, and that gives you the regular screen, audio books, songs all of that. Podcast, go into settings, here's photos. I can show photos, you know, of my family. There's my boys. Some pictures that I've taken of them. But uh, anyway, so it's sort of nice to have that on there. And guess what? It's also got a radio. Now there's no radio signal. Got to plug in headphones with uh, for radio reception, unfortunately. Uh, podcasts that I listen to, you know, I've got a bunch of them in there. Uh, I've already shown you the photos. I like the iPad, iPod Nano. It's kind of a, a nice little uh, little iPod. It's real small. This one I think is an eight gigabyte model, um, and it, you know, it's got the multi-touch gesturing. It doesn't rotate automatically, but you can rotate it. So the iPod Nano is actually a neat little device. In fact, it's the best miniature MP3 player that I've ever seen. So so I really like it. I got this one uh, as a part of a promotion with an audio uh, book subscription to Audible through Amazon. And I will post a link to that article where I showed you how you can get one for $100 off. So basically, I bought this one for just uh, a little bit over that. Um, mainly just because I wanted the, the subscription. But I thought, you know, this would be cool. Let's try it out see how it works. Now there's a, um, some more fashionable watch bands coming here in the future. This one is, uh, I believe it was $25. I got it on the, in the Apple store. Um, I'm not a real fan of this rubberized kind of feel. Notice it kind of picks up lint, so I'm forever going to have to clean it and, you know, get that off. So it's, it's not really the best looking band in the world so I'm interested to see what uh, some of the other ones I've seen on Kickstarter there's a group that's making a much more fashionable looking one and I, I might uh, go ahead and pick that up and see how that looks but it's got the volume on it so as you see it works fine and here's your power button notice when you hit the power the first thing it shows is the time um, I have a, an auxiliary jack in my new Honda Pilot, and this works real well with it. Uh, probably what I'll honestly end up doing is leaving the iPod Nano in my car and uh, just have that always connected so that I don't always have to hook up my iPhone. But I just want to show it off to you. I thought it was kind of a, I don't know, almost a... Uh, uh, Anyway, I, th I thought it was just kind of a, uh, a neat little product, <laughs> kind of an interesting idea, maybe not the best execution uh, of all the ones. This is probably the most interesting one. 
and uh, except for the the way that it sort of looks bad. But this has been Kevin Purcell for Notebooks.com. Thanks for watching.